Hey guys, welcome back to Islands in Shit Amnesia. Oh god. Well, we're in the sewers. And shit. Was that crouched? Oh, okay. Okay, I haven't recorded in a while because I've been pretty much sick, I guess. Yeah, I guess I've been sick, I mean. Isn't it dangerous allowing this filthy discharge to collect so close to the core? It's a we can use the flow to drive the turbines. There will always be a torrent of excreta flooding through these tunnels. We can use this to supplement the steam production and ensure constancy. God, the stench! This fecal matter is the true product of the age. Okay, so... You left me a note. Nice. Flooded tunnels. A mysterious friend... A mysterious friend is correct. The sewers are indeed flooded to descent further. I will have to find the lo the local sl sluice pumps to drop the water level. The smell is almost unbearable. It makes me gag. Why should this saboteur flood the tunnels though? Why did he hope to achieve? What did he hope to achieve? Why did he hope to achieve? It makes no sense. So what's this way? Skillington. Naturally, once bled, the product must be scaled, dehaired, and syrup ready for. Glamberling and devisceration. For though for this we pass them through the steam reservoir, which is kept at a constant temperature by passing excess high pressure van venting from the engines via the boil and series of large copper pipes into a stone chamber just below the walkhouse. Fit the centre of the machine there is there is a component that must be kept at a constantly low temperature, which controls operations of the set of the processing of product throughout the system. Alongside this, refrigeration is of the most utmost importance in retaining product quality and this also requires heat to be removed from certain areas of the machine. Two problems are therefore combined into a single solution, the removal of heat from some areas and the requirements for a ceased heat in others. Conducting panels draw heat using the principles of convec convection, regulated by the boiler and sending freezing air along one set of pipes in one direction and superheated vapours in another. Okay, that means nothing to me. <laughs> well, that must mean something, but I don't understand. <laughs> It's good to know, isn't it? Oh, shit. What the hell is that? Oh, look, it's a water monster reborn. As a lightning motherfucker. I can't see shit. I forgot I had this again. Can I go over here? Uh. Okay, no, so there's only one way I can go at the minute. That's fair enough. What? Oh god. Oh, I'm swimming in shit too. God, I don't want to go that way. I don't want to go anyway. Yes, that way I am going. Fair dues. Fair dues. Okay, so thank fuck for that. Oh, good lord. Okay. Ah! Oh, it's you again, you fuck. Stop. It's really annoying. Oh, wait, I don't want to be doing that. Okay. I gotta get over there then. 
Do I have to, or? I don't think I can make that. I guess I'll go here. Mm, going this right way, it says. <coughs> okay. <coughs> I'm freaking out right now. Several of the older forms have breached their containment area and escaped into the sewers. They remind me of my limitations. This is no claim and I'm no Eliaho. Eliahu? At least not quite yet. It is the heat generated from keeping the doorway between open that is to blame. We can't simply pack them about the coolant as we do at the centre where the doorway is. The later versions are keep are kept safe by the freezing temperature of those towers up here, where the air is hot and fetid. They become overheated and their duty tears them asun tears them asunder. As the other place flies from their cells and their vital splinters, they live spor sporadically, turn from one to the other and back again in violent, unpredictable bursts. For a few seconds, they are creatures of this world, then they are torn away and cease to have physical form. This vicious ripping back and forth between worlds has driven them quite insane. I have ordered the affected area sealed and will not allow my loyal workers to enter. These are damn places now. The abode of failed experiments, ghosts of fear and spite. Oh, fucking brilliant. Fucking, what's wrong with my screen? Stab screen, you are fucking around. Okay. It's the gate one. Oh. Hello. Yeah. So which one is that unlocked? Okay. No. Is he gone? Ah! No, he's not gone. <laughs> okay. I guess I have to go back then? Yes. It's opened up a tunnel. Hmm? Oh. Okay. It's open now then. Oh. Oh! Don't. Don't. Why is it so fucking dark? Okay, so that's lowered slightly. Okay. Okay. So I can... Do I go in there? No, I can't go in there. Okay. Oh! Oh, it's you. Wait, fucking shut up. No. Okay. Am I back at the beginning again? Am I? Bloody hell. Ah! Oh, I can go this way now. Okay. Okay. So now, uh, that is the question. Hello? But we can save them. We can set them free. We can replace a rotten old world with a clean new one. Mr. Anders, you sound every bit the fanatic. Well, how can I be otherwise, Professor? How can any man of ethics simply stand by and watch this world drown in its own excrement? And your engineer, this visionary with whom you embarked upon this course, does he show you? Indeed he does, indeed he does. The poor fellow has seen it all before. Now, this is not the first great civilization he has wept for. 
And so you set about things immediately upon your return? Naturally, naturally. These things cannot be left to rot upon the tree. And sponsors were remarkably easy to find. I tell you, Professor, a trail of greed brings rich men to your door like pigs to truffles. <coughs> Literally. <coughs> so... Ah! Have I just... Have, ah! Oh, let's just find that. Okay, fair enough. Oh, you fuck. Why? I'm finding it odd how, like, they all tend to... Well, I notice that they're all running away from me. I don't know why. It's just scared of me or something. Oh, they know I'm coming to kill them. I'm going to kill them. I'm going to let you the motherfuckers. But, uh... I noticed that a lot of them seem to run away from me, actually. Weird. I've only been attacked twice. Oh. And I said, look, my darlings, can you see it? And they said, yes, daddy, yes, we see it. A tall weathered cap of a steel-sided pyramid, so like those of Egypt, stone falling away on the summit, divines crawling about, intertwining. The stucco serpents that thrive about the steps. A palpable sense of stillness, a weight of forgotten. And this, here, yeah, this is where the k king sat. And this is where the priests lived. This house, this is the house of the dead. And here, where the sun strikes, this is where they threw the hearts that were not consumed. No, my darlings, they must certainly were not savages. You see, they believed that the sky could fall on their heads, and they truly, truly believed that offering blood was the only way of stopping this from happening. Perhaps, my darling, perhaps they were mistaken altogether. Or perhaps their tragedy was that they could not, they could simply not spill blood enough to prevent the sky from falling upon them. Good, teach your kids some really good stuff, don't you, bro? Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Yeah! Crouching. <laughs> Crouching. Of course, I generally can't go that way. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. That's done it. Now I can enter the strange decontamination chamber once again and move onwards. The waters are pushed back, making the way to the bridge clear, where I can divert the remainder of this filthy torrent back into the Thames, where it belongs, and clear the path to the centre of the machine. Oh god. Do I have to? <laughs> <coughs> I don't want to. Fuck my kids. You really want to kill me, don't you? Touch up, motherfucker! Tough luck! That's it, Papa. You're so near now. Yay! Uh. Oh, look at that. Oh, you can't get me. Oh, look at that. I drained the water. I drained the water. No. I finished the sewer level. Or I'm just going fucking deeper. Which seems about right. <laughs> Clean me. Okay, I can now. Okay. I'm still in the super sewers. <laughs> God damn it. Oh. Bastard, that was mean. Oh, oh, poor piggy. Oh, that was horrible. You, oh, oh, that was so mean. 
Oh, I feel so bad for them now. Well, the small ones, anyway. Dick. The shit is go. Oh my god. I guess they patrol them. This is nasty stuff. What are they? Are they eating? Ugh. It's not. It's not. Oh sh. Oh, you're just going back and forth. Okay, you're patrolling. Wait, what's that? <clears throat> nest of wretches. Dear God, a oh, whole nest of these foul creatures. No mind my instincts have drawn me this far, and I'm sure somehow in this dark complex is a means of further descent. I will not see their faces as they go about their dark business, and yet... And yet, I watch them sleep and eat and play, and they're so very human, so very childlike. I will not think of what I have seen of the chairs and the cages. I will not think of how much monsters may be scul sculptured. Oh, poor things. Oh, I feel so bad for them now. I genuinely feel bad for them. Where's that bastard? I'm gonna punch him. Dickhead. Oh shit. Hmm, I'm scared again. <laughs> Building blocks. Oh, that's so cute. Aww. Who's see? Ah, ah. Oh, who's done this to them? Seriously, I can't believe he's done such horrible shit to these poor things. I feel bad now. Hey, okay, piggy, piggy. Oh, oh no, it's okay. Piggy, I'm not gonna hurt ya. Hello. Oh, he's so cute. Poor things. What's in here? Piggy. Oh. <laughs> Piggy! Oh, you're chained. Oh, that's awful. Oh, this is horrible. Oh, sorry. Is that blinding you? I'm sorry. Oh, God. The bigger ones are horrible to the little ones. Oh, God. Ugh. Please stop doing that. It's going this way. No, no. Let me see the piggy. Oh, that one's asleep. Oh, I feel so bad for the piggies. I hope that's not his friend dead on the floor. Hello, Piggy. Hello? Hello, Piggy? Are you masturbating? Oh, this place is horrible. I don't like that noise! Please don't snort. <laughs> Where's that coming from? Oh, 
Guess I'm going lower. I can't, I can't see shit. Ah! Oh. Um. Guess I'm going here. Oh shit. What's going on? What's going on? Hello? Hello? Eeny meeny miny mo. Go this way. I'll go the other way. Oh, lag. I don't know where to go if I'm going the right way on. Oh. I guess I have to go down. Whee! Ow. I could have done it a bit gentler than that. <coughs> I can't go that way. Huh. Oh, it's dark again. Is it going to meet me at the bottom? Oh, God. Oh, God. <gasps> oh, God. Oh God. So, either this way or that way. I'll go this way. Hope it goes all the same way anyway. Deeper, deeper into the depths of hell we go. I honestly feel quite bad for the pigs now. I mean... Just the fact that that happened to him. That was the same. Stop! This is not the best place to be. I'm going to find like a dead body just fall down on me in a minute. <laughs> when will this stop? I just I don't want to be here anymore. Oh god. Oh god. End of the line! From tie to spine, a skin of a shroud, a stump of the blade, or lily is flyborn, or lily is dead, and dreams of the jungle will flood through her head and light up her head. <laughs> I don't know how that was scary, but okay. <laughs> well, I'm gonna pause it here for now, guys. Uh, <laughs> and we'll see where this takes us. Probably somewhere horrific, but uh, who knows? Yeah, it's somewhere horrific. Okay. Okay. Have a good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night.